Good morning guys from a very scary hair situation. I've just done my hair as I'm about to go and shoot with my lovely friend India. I'm actually not that massively hungry but I know I need to eat. So I'm going to make a smoothie and I'm just going to make it super quick, super easy and yeah I'll show you what is inside. So first off I use a Nutribilla. Okay so fresh berries, one banana, add some water so I can let that melt. I've got some things from Sauce, just that, that kind of refill place. So I've got some vanilla protein powder, and that's made out of pea protein, some maca. I use maca because it's really good for hormone imbalance and also blood levels. I'm going to add some chia seeds for fibre. So yeah, so I've been really making sure that I've been taking maca at the moment because it's super important for not only women, women health, like human health in general, um, but it's known to have actually quite good benefits for women to take it for hormones and regulation and stuff like that. I'm also going to be adding the, this is the JS Health and Vitality and Collagen Nourish and Glow. You can add this just to water if you fancy, but for a quick and easy way to just get everything in, I just add it into a smoothie. Because I just think it's so much quicker. I'm gonna add a bit of peanut butter because Yum, good healthy fats, and then we blend. And that is my morning smoothie. I feel like I look really, <laughs> really tanned right now, and my hair is very wild, but I am about to go and shoot with India, so I'm all prepped and primed. I'm actually in a little blue dress, but I'm getting the bus, so I'm like trying to cover myself with this like oversized grey blazer. Um, but yeah, we um, we're off to shoot. We've got a couple of campaigns and work we need to do, and then we're actually going to go for lunch at the Bluebird as India was kindly invited, um, and I'm her plus one, so it works out really well. And it's a massive bonus when we do shoot because the thing is, we do shoot every like all the time all day long and it's very exhausting and also as well that means you have to get lunch out so the the benefit of getting a gifted meal is that we're not always spending money on food out if that makes sense i'm sure yes we probably could take a lunch box but is that really fun <laughs> no and i literally would literally look like silly little kids sitting in the bench on the bench eating our little lunch box i mean i wouldn't care to be fair um but yeah long story short I might need to curl that bit again. Um, I'm about to head out to go and shoot with India. Sorry about the roadworks. Um, we're going to Covent Garden. We're going to go to Trafalgar Square. And then we are going to go to like the London Eye. And then we're going to head over to Chelsea to go to Bluebird. And then from there, we will go our separate ways. Um, and yeah, it'll be a really nice day. It's supposed to clear up. It's supposed to. Um, I didn't go on a run this morning, which I really wanted to, but it just looked so dark and gloomy outside. It literally felt like winter. I was a bit like, mm. And I'm literally in a little dress. So, yeah, we'll see how eventful this one is. But, yeah, I'm ready to go. So I'm just going to quickly curl this bit before I head out. And, um, yeah, and then I'll take you along for the rest of the week. I've got some really exciting things going on. I'm going to stop rambling, so I'll catch you guys in a bit. Great vlogger. Vlogger, right here. So, um, <laughs> we're on the bus. Hi. I'm with India. Um, we had a mare, didn't we? We had a mare, so we've been shooting around Covent Garden. Station. We've been shooting around Covent Garden and like wanting to shoot around Trafalgar Square because we're shooting content with Fiji. Um, so we had to do like city locations and things like that. And there is this massive protest going on. Which is a, like, we're both like, yeah, it's important. Oh my god, yeah. However, <laughs> not convenient with our job with me didn't we were like planning to shoot around Trafalgar square and it literally was like just not impossible it wasn't impossible anyway so we're now on our way to bluebird and okay take two <laughs> so yes we're on our way to bluebird we've been trying to book ubers all like for the last hour and it's been a nightmare due to the protest so we're now on a bus which actually worked out quite well because it literally goes straight there goes straight there like smashing um but yeah we're on our way we've shot we've done well we've done loads of outfits gonna shoot two more 
two more and then we're gonna go for lunch. I'm so excited. So I'll see. So see you guys in a bit. <laughs> Johnny. Right. So we have got one more outfit to shoot for ins. We are now heading to Bluebird. We're just down this beautiful road. Honestly, the houses here are incredible. But I'm in my final outfit. This is from a job I'm doing with Oak Trio. And it's a wreath blazer. So very fancy. I really like the dog tooth and really cute for autumn. Yay. But yeah, we're gonna head to Bluebird now. Ooh. So we are now at the Bluebird and we are here. Well, India's here with Lele which is that vermouth company that I did, the one in Sloane Square. If you've watched previous vlogs, they did a pop-up with Colbert in Sloane Square. And now they're doing one with the Bluebird, which is just fantastic. So India kindly invited me as a plus one. So we have all these cocktails here. We ordered the flower spritz, but I think we've got the blank spritz because yeah, totally we got good. some straws. Yeah, I'm very confused. I'm confused, it but, but hey-ho. But yeah, so we're here on the little courtyard bit. I ordered, actually I don't know how I've ordered now. I ordered yeah. this artichoke salad and then the squid and some cherry sorbet. India ordered a vegan cheeseburger. Yeah, the I've gone vegan. Yeah. Today. Apart from the burrata. Yeah. We, vegetarian. Yeah, vegetarian. vegetarian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the burrata and then this, the vegan bakewell tart, which sounds sublime. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're done. Well, we've got one more outfit to shoot with Vins. And then we're pretty much done for the day, which is lovely. So I love this bit. We've done all the shooting. I don't know if you can hear me. We've done all the shooting and yeah, now we kind of relax. So I'll show you our food when it comes because we are very excited. We are hungry. So this is our starters. I went for this art baby artichoke salad, which looks delicious. I'm actually really glad I went for it. And then Inns went for the burrata with tomatoes. And it looks so good. And we've got our cocktails. Fabulous. So India got the large, <laughs> the largest dish of chips ever. Guys. It looks good though. It looks very luminous. And then I've gone for octopus and some side salad, which you're more than welcome to have as well. Thanks, darling. And delicious. Nice. So happy Tuesday. I actually can't believe it's only Tuesday that is ridiculous but i'm just about to head out i'm off to meet my family for dinner in greenwich which will be really lovely we are going to go and celebrate my brother's birthday which will be so nice we're gonna go and go to sticks and sushi i believe so i'm just kind of like in a i feel like it looks like quite a nice casual dinner attire um it actually kind of looks like a play suit which i'm not mad about i've got this old boohoo top on which i'll leave a similar down below and then my um river island trousers which are just so comfortable um but yeah sorry i'm picking up the camera quite late in the evening i've been doing something very exciting and very nerve-wracking um but i can't speak about it um and i'm not too sure if i'll get it or anything like that but yeah i'm gonna leave it there but they've topped up my makeup and it does actually look really lovely on camera so i think i think i'm okay i think i'm ready to go and then i've actually actually got a blazer this khaki blazer which i'm quite obsessed with i just love the color um so i think i'm going to wear this as well i just think it looks very very cool so i might actually put some what's it called hair bands hair bands that's the word hair bands on my sleeves to hold it up so if you've got like if you want to hold up the material just to make it look a little bit more cooler as one would say just get your hairband you just pop it under and then you just roll it up under roll it over nobody's gonna know and that should hold your sleeve up it's just a nice easy way of doing it holding it up and yeah i'm not gonna be able to touch my hair very proud of myself i just blow dried it with the dyson air wrap and i actually quite like this kind of undone wavy look so this is my outfit for the evening what do you guys think it's like a casual cool vibe 
I want to say, blazer from Zara, Boohoo, uh, River Island, and my Fendi sandals. I thought this was quite a nice, cool look. And then I'm going to pair it with my Chloe bag. So I'll probably not film, but what I might do is just take videos and stuff of the food. And yeah, hope you enjoy it. And I'll probably catch you properly up tomorrow. See you guys. So we have ordered. Wow. No, I love it. We just got some matcha stuff. Well, no, I got a matcha frappuccino. I've got a caramel. So we got that. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> the girl that can't have dairy and she's literally like, oh, dollar. <laughs> So we've just been to Starbucks and with Chloe. We ventured out of our usual order. We ventured out. I've gone for like a frappuccino matcha with sugar-free vanilla yeah. syrup. I feel like one of those girls. I, I feel like we're such Americans. Like, you know, they go to like in-depth So I got a um, like a matcha frappuccino with oat milk and sugar-free vanilla syrup. I don't think I can do this. So. <laughs> we're doing a caramel frappuccino. It looks so good. With oat milk. We're off on a shoe day today, round Notting Hill. I feel like we're going to be on a sugar high now. I know. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to go and mooch around the area. I haven't really shot around Notting Hill before. Yeah, I used to shoot here a lot with Michaela. Oh, okay. Oh. So you can show us all the areas. Oh. Right, so we'll catch you guys pretty. in a bit. Yeah. Cheers. I'm taking over Amelia's vlog. She's trying to get an aesthetic shot of her nails this and a little matcha. You're on your second matcha of the day. I know. I'm gonna be, I yeah, like two on how to get the shot. <laughs> Still <laughs> good. <laughs> Sometimes it's good to get a bit of like fabric in there. Match your outfit, match your nails, match your matcha, match your matcha. <laughs> So in a frying pan, I've just done some garlic, onion, bit of chili. I grated some lemon and seasoning. I've done like oregano, um, balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar cooks so lovely. It kind of goes like nice and caramelized and a little bit of paprika. And I've also just put a vegetarian stock cube in here. And I'm just going to give that a stir and that will just melt away and create a really nice stock which I will start the risotto with. <laughs> on my hair this one i've been actually very excited for so this is the phillips body building bond builder mask which you apply in your hair before going to the shower so i'm just going to apply this on my hair so i can then go and do a workout and then i can have a shower and this will be ready to go so it just says apply before shampoo and freely wet hair and apply in sections leave on for 10 to 20 minutes the longer the better so that's what I'm doing. So I'm just kind of like starting at the bottom and working my way up. I had a little bit of a mare this morning. I've kind of focused my morning around an event I had today. I've got so much to do, like filming, I'm going away tonight, like just a weekend away, but one still needs to pack. And um, yeah, I got the wrong day, it's very annoying. So we move, I am gonna do a workout because I know it'll make me feel better, but yeah. I'm just going to stick to my schedule. But it's just annoying because I could have started earlier today. Which is fine. I've done a bit of work. I've had breakfast. I'm hoping that I'll have a quite a good workout because I've got some food in me. 
and um yeah we shall see but yeah so i've got a busy day today i've got a good good workout and then i've got film a zara video i've got also i've got some lily silk things which have arrived which is very exciting so i will show you those and um yeah then i've got a pack got to edit some bits and bobs to send off I'm just kind of like get the house and myself ready before going away making sure everything's locked up clean tidy um so when helena comes it's all good so yeah so just kind of like a running around day i did actually want to get to zara just to go and get like a big jumper or something um but i'm hoping that when i'm packing i realize i won't need anything but i would like to get stuff so um we shall see. Hello guys. So I'm jumping on here to do a little bit of an unboxing. We all know that I do like a little bit of a haul in my vlogs. I just find that doing these hauls and sharing it with you guys in this format is just a bit more natural and talking to my friends kind of vibes. And very excitingly, this is an integrated partnership with Lily Silk, which is very exciting. Lily Silk is a brand that I've seen on my favorite YouTubers videos and have always been desiring to try it. And very excitingly, they have gotten contact contact to let me try some out and also do a collaboration with them so super excited thank you so much lily silk for partnering with me on this video so i have a bit of a mixture of product by the name they are called lily silk so a lot of beautiful homeware and clothing products which are made out of silk so i'm going to share with them with you show you what i've got and also trial them on myself and in my home so first off i picked out these scrunchies I am super super cautious with my hair recently at the moment. I've been a little bit more, let's say cautious with my hair recently. How I put it up, how I style it, how regularly I style it, what I put on my hair is just super important. Last year I did suffer with a bit of hair damage due to a tool, not to name a name in any name. So I'm really trying to get my hair back into the health that it was. And one thing that I've been really trying to apply into my everyday life is using products which are going to help and protect so one product two products that i want to share with you within this lily silk order is to do with hair care so the first ones are some silk scrunchies these are super key to helping with your hair breakage so if you are one to tie their hair up quite a lot you will notice you probably have quite a lot of breakage where you have it tight in that hair band so that's where lily silk comes very handy is because silk's going to help with kind of just protecting your hair against that kind of everyday damage you don't get any friction which is which causes you damage so using these hair bands or a silk pillowcase which i'm going to go on to is going to really help with less friction less damage less breakage it's also going to help with like protecting it from irritation so i love to put my hair up all the time especially when i have days where i'm not styling it so to be a bit more supportive with my hair i love to wear a silk hairband and these are just the cutest accessories so i've gone for a really nice like i want to say like a taupey satin color a navy a classic black this gorgeous beautiful pink and this white and i absolutely adore how big they are they just look so pretty in your hair and you can wear them like a little ballerina and i just absolutely love them so really happy i've been able to top up on those so and on to another product which i tapped into just then about using silk for your hair is a silk pillowcase and a silk pillowcase is really beneficial not only to your hair but your skin so for your hair again it's going to help prevent usual friction which your hair does with if you're sleeping on for instance like cotton it's a little bit more dry and so it's going to keep your hair hydrated and normal it's also going to help prevent any irritation that you have when you sleep and you like toss and turn your hair it is also a cleaner surface to sleep on and like i said it's less drying for your hair and your skin so with skin as well it helps with like i said it's a cleaner surface so it's going to prevent and protect against bacteria it also helps reduce and prevent wrinkles and, and again like i said it's going to stop that friction between your face your hair with the pillowcase and that's what i just absolutely love about them so this was one of the first things i bought when I knew my hair was needing some massive TLC I wanted to invest into some lovely silk pillowcases so 
I'm really excited to have a couple more in the bank because they are just so handy. I like to use them once a week and then I put them in the wash. So I've gone for just like a really nice classic ivory silk and I've got, and I have two of them. So I have one either side. So I have two because when my boyfriend stays over, obviously I need to help him with anti-aging as well. But it's just really good to have a couple so you're not, so you're not waiting on one for it to be washed and cleaned. So you've always got a nice fresh one in the cupboard ready to go when you are washing your others. They come in a lovely array of colours. I saw a pink on there which I thought would actually be really cute with my bed but I've gotten just for a classic because I like to wear because I like to put them at the back. You can see I've got one on now but yeah really love these. Next up is two items and two items that I thought were just classic essentials especially for this transitional weather we're going in but these can be worn in any season. So first I've gone for this silk black cami. I just feel like you just cannot go wrong with a gorgeous silk cami. This could be worn on its own with a pair of shorts or some jeans and a blazer. Just really cute, really sexy. It's got this really just a really cute top and it's got this really nice v-neck which I thought was really lovely and again it comes in a array of really lovely colours but I just wanted to keep to black to try it on first but I definitely think I'm going to go back and get maybe it in white or like that really nice like champagne colour that would look stunning. What I also love as well is that they don't have a tag at the back so it's not itchy it's actually hidden down on the side and I went for a medium which is a UK 10 just so I can have it a little bit more oversized and comfortable and then I went for another classic black shirt this is what i was really excited for i've been really into like my black kind of like crop top boy t-shirts i don't know if you can see it i'll try it on for you but it's like this really nice like crepey silk material oh actually it's just 100 percent mulberry silk that's amazing and it feels so different it's like a really nice kind of like a matte silk that's a nice way of explaining it so yeah really excited to pair this with some shorts a little skirt i feel like that would be really cute so that came perfectly in time for going away on holiday. Both of these perfect key items for going away on holiday. I've just spotted as well, they've also put in a really cute silk bag. I've never seen that before, but I believe this is for their 11th year anniversary and it's for the everyday and forevermore. They're so cute. So thank you very much to Lily Silk for sending that over. I am absolutely adoring this cami. I've styled it so like it's kind of like a, a dress up vibe. So I paired it with a pair of shorts, some little mule kitten heels and my black Chloe bag. And I just think that looks really lovely. What I really like about this top as well, it's got some really nice thick straps. So you can wear a bra with that, which is amazing. So I feel really comfortable. It's so soft on my skin, which is really lovely. And that's a really lovely thing about silk is that it's super clean it's super gentle on your skin and it's not going to cause any irritations it's super comfortable and it's so lovely and yeah i'm absolutely adoring this and i just thought that was actually quite a nice day out or dressing up really comfortable you could definitely tuck it in as well but i actually like it quite um just like loose and kind of like layered with the shorts i think that looks really lovely so really happy with this one and then i've actually kept my outfit on again just to show you it i hope you can see it in this lighting but i am wearing the shirt short sleeve version and it is such a lovely fit this is so gorgeous and not only i obviously don't go to an office but it would work really lovely as a everyday workwear shirt as well it's super comfortable you can definitely dress this up and dress it down i'm wondering if you can see it a little bit more better in this lighting but yeah it's so comfortable and it just tucks in really lovely and i'm obsessed with it so again i've just paired it with the outfit i was just wearing with those really nice shorts but also as well again you can pair it with some trousers and you can definitely pair it with some trainers like really casual it down maybe take it out if you want to bit have it a bit more casual but also i'm really thinking this would look really lovely on the beach with a little bikini underneath like a little chuck on absolutely adore it. it is so comfortable i'm really happy with it and i definitely think i'd love to get it in a white as well because i can just see myself i can see myself wearing this quite a lot and i actually really like the sleeves they're just really perfectly fitting in the right areas and yeah i feel really comfortable in it so absolutely loving this 
So I have just changed my silk pillowcases for some new fresh ones and they look so dreamy. I cannot wait to sleep on these tonight. So I wanted to quickly show you how gorgeous they are. They're just so beautiful and fitting. They do need a bit of a steam, but do you know what? I am not that fussy about it when it comes to bedding because I actually quite like that kind of undone look. It looks so comfortable, but yeah, the creases will just come out very quickly um, on their own or with a steamer or an ironing. But yeah, they fit so beautiful, like a glove. I think these are my favorite silk pillowcases and I actually really want to get the pink ones or that champagne kind of color I got of the bubbles would look really lovely with my um like kind of like display pillows and fro so yeah really happy with that so they look just so sweet so yeah I am over the moon with the beautiful lily silk products I think I'm gonna leave the shirt on and I'm gonna tuck straight into bed because they just look like the dream these silk pillowcases and I'm just over the moon how fitting they are they are just absolutely gorgeous and I'm so excited I think I'm gonna do an order now as now I know my sizing and what fits that I really like and that I've been inspired with just getting the classic pieces and now I really want like the champagne pillowcases maybe some pink ones and definitely get this in a white or a different color because I just know that it's going to be such a timeless piece in my wardrobe I definitely think I'm going to be doing a, another little order but other than that massive thank you to Lily Silk for partnering with me on this part of the video really exciting and yeah really happy with the Cool. so everything will be linked down below including the sizing massive apologies about the building it's just not gonna stop so it's out of my control so i hope you don't mind but yeah i'm really happy with it but yeah i'm gonna leave everything that i've spoken about down below with the sizing so i hope you enjoy let me know if you pick out anything so yeah now i'm going to quickly have some lunch before filming another video i'm going to be filming a little zara haul i ordered some Zara pieces um over the week for the weekend but they never arrived um which is fine because I'm gonna film it now and do a little bit of a styling video and um a bit of a reel but I'm gonna eat first because I know that I'm gonna get hangry if I don't so I'm gonna sit down have something to eat and then crack on with this video so I've gone for a bit of a stir fry salad kale some vegan mayo which is insane it's like the sriracha one um, some courgette, broccoli, tiny bit of vegan cheese, and yeah, I'm gonna tuck into this little salad and then crack on with Phil. Right, video is complete, ready to go. So now what I'm gonna do is make a coffee and I'm going to put this all away, organize everything, and then start packing. And then I'm gonna see if I need to go into Zara. That is the only way I can go into Zara. Um, I am um, then so Loz is gonna come up Loz is gonna come up to mine um after work. We were gonna try and leave early before rush hour, but it's just not possible. He is so busy and hard working at the moment. Um so what we're gonna do is eat dinner here and then we're gonna drive later on tonight, which will actually be alright and actually probably a lot nicer. So yeah, so I'm gonna do a quick clean around in here because it's a little bit messy and I want to leave it all clean make a coffee start packing and then yeah I think I'll have a few hours to decide if I need to do a quick snippet to Zara so I did go to Zara I just forgot to show you but I picked up this really cute jumper that I am so over the moon about I was umming and ahhing about it and I was like oh I don't know if I'm gonna like it I love it it is it is soft, it is so cosy, it is the perfect, the perfect UK beach jumper. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. I've just put it on top of some white jeans, my little sandals, and I love it. Oh my god, I'm so happy. Right, um, so I'm back to happy. So what I'm going to do now, everything I know that I want is already out, all good to go. I just need to iron now, I'm going to iron and then put it all away. So... I'm gonna do that 
I was gonna put you on a time lapse for that, for that, but I feel like that'd be so boring. Um, oh, I love this jumper. It's very like, um, like a rugby vibe kind of thing. I got it in a size medium. I'll leave it down below. Um, but I think it's just such a cute jumper. And I also, my plan was to have like also a halter neck, halter neck on, some shorts, and this like over the top as well. I thought that would look quite cute. So yeah, so I've got, I've got options. So yeah, I'm gonna iron and then pack everything. I'll show you what I pack. Okay, excuse if you can hear the tumble dryer in the background, but I'm just about to pack. I've just ironed everything. So I wanted to kind of go through everything that I've got in here. I feel like it's gonna be a heavy one. I don't know why I'm just like panic. You know when you just like have a panic about outfits, and I'm like every I was like organised, and I'm like, oh, this is all quite a lot. Just finishing up now. Some tools, okay, perfect. So yeah, so I thought I'd quickly go through everything that I'm packing, and hopefully be somewhat interesting. So first off, beauty stuff. I've got this massive space NK travel bag, which is just honestly it's got my skincare in here it's got my makeup it's got my makeup remover it's got tampons it's got hair stuff in it this is your absolute i'm like this this is your hero this is just phenomenal so it's got everything i need in there i'm also going to take my ghd rise because that's just like a really good tool um my hair dryer is kind of okay um naturally if i'm going to wash my hair but i like to have a bit of a kink at the end so like as you can see today i've just done like a quick blow dry um so it's kind of just like oh, it looks a bit crazy today so i'm not touching it but it still looks nice and i don't think about it too much makeup brush it hair brush she's all ready to go and i've also got a clip a little claw this is full of bikinis underwear i feel like i might have packed too much let me let me go through it friday saturday sunday monday four okay cool and then an extra face mask because you never know so that's like a little chloe duster i also have another duster in here which is really handy um, and I put like all my dirty washing in there, which I think is quite good. It's like a really big one. Just already in there. Sandals of choice, Fendi sandals. Because why not? I probably get ruined though. Do I wear them? Oh, who knows? Cards. We've got, I've just got a plain pack of cards and Uno. Because we forgot that last time and I'm not going to lie, I was a little bit gutted. Um, outfits. Okay, so first off, let's go with the essentials. A big jumper. Night one outfit, beach day shirt, then a night two outfit, which is like a little white dress. And then I'm gonna wear that with my green blazer. This cute cord from Pretty Lavish, which can be worn together or on its own. And that's quite handy, because then I'm gonna bring my hammy top, which I can wear with the shorts and the blazer I'm bringing. I'm gonna bring up my gym wear to be maybe a bit optimistic. You never know, I might want to. And I'm gonna bring the jumper. What am I packing? White shirt for the beach. Do you know what? I don't care. Some white jeans, just in case it's cold. And and then maxi dress and a just in case Isabel Mar dress. I think that's actually quite good. And then trainers. I'm doing a campaign for this company called Sperry. They're really cute. Um, so like little boat shoes. So then I'm gonna wedge those in the side. Oh, she's stuffed. She is stuffed. It's because I've got jumpers in here. That's my situation. It's because I've got jumpers. It's a bit more bulked up, which is not ideal, but do what you gotta do. I'm just doing it. I've got everything. Oh, no, wait, I haven't got my toothbrush. I'll pack it in my handbag. <sighs> Dunning. I forgot to add <laughs> my toothbrush, a makeup removing cloth, and a razor. Okay, she's ready to go. So, laptop, and I've got my laptop case and i'm charging my laptop i'm gonna bring my laptop and my i'm not gonna bring my ipad because i keep thinking i've got loads of time but i won't probably have time out there um and i'm bringing my lueve basket bag as like my little carry-on and then i've got phone charger in here sunglasses lip liners so it's just gonna be like my hold all stuff and then actually nicely i just bought this from amazon that fits in there quite nicely like so and then i'm gonna be wearing my new balances yeah i always regret that i want to bring more stuff 
Uh, anyway, thank you so much, guys. I don't know if you can hear me because of the tumble dryer, but thank you so much for watching this vlog, guys. I hope it was somewhat interesting. Thank you also as well to Lily Silk for sponsoring part of this video. If you liked it, please like and subscribe. It really supports my channel. Other than that, I am not going to vlog this weekend because I'm going to have a weekend off and it's with friends who I don't think would want to be vlogged thank you so much for watching everything i'll try and leave everything down below other than that i will catch you later bye guys